Hello everyone, welcome to the book and notes. This video is part 6 of class 11 chemistry, chapter 3, the periodic classification of element. And this is the last part. And here we will study the electron gain enthalpy. And it is defined as the amount of energy released when an electron is added to the outermost cell of one mole of an isolated gaseous atom in its lower energy state. And there is a question that is electron gain enthalpy positive or negative and the answer to this question is the electron gain enthalpy can be positive or negative depending upon the nature of element to which the electron is to be added however for most of the element it is generally negative that is exothermic now let us come to next question Group 17 element have very high negative electron gain enthalpy. Explain why. An answer to this question is Group 17 element have very high, ele high negative electron gain enthalpy because they can attain stable noble gas configuration by picking up an electron. Now, another question Noble gases have very large positive electron gain enthalpy why answer is this the valence cell of noble gases are completely filled so there is no need to add or remove electron in this configuration but if we add electron to the configuration then electron enters in the next higher principal energy quantum level leading to high unstable configuration and for this a large amount of energy is required and therefore electron gain enthalpy of noble gases has large positive value now the factor affecting electron affinity are atomic size effective nuclear charge screening effect and electronic configuration now there is a note that negative electron gain enthalpy when electron are added without supplying energy then the energy released is more negative electron gain enthalpy and when electron are added by supplying extra energy then the energy released is less negative electron gain enthalpy now let us come to trends in electron affinity and the first trend is variation along period the value of electron gain enthalpy become more negative on moving from left to right along the period because the atomic size decreases and the effective nuclear charge increases as a result the added electron on the valence cell would be strongly attracted by the nucleus now let us come to variation along group the value the value of electron gain enthalpy becomes less negative on moving down a group because the atomic size increases which decreases the actual force of attraction by the nucleus now let us come to a question that which of the following will have the most negative electron gain enthalpy and which is least negative among phosphorus sulfur chlorine fluorine and the answer is as we know that the negative value of electron gain enthalpy increases along a period and decreases on moving down the group but the elements of the second period like fluorine have lesser electron affinity than the corresponding third period this is because of smaller size and hence greater repulsion in case of uh, fluorine as compared to chlorine thus the order of electron gain enthalpy is p is smaller than uh, sulfur is smaller than fluorine is smaller than chlorine hence chlorine has most negative electron gain enthalpy while p phosphorus has least now let us come to electronegativity electronegativity is the tendency of an atom 
to attract shared pair electron in a covalent bond it is the relative property hence it is it has no unit the difference between electron affinity and electron negativity the points are electron affinity is defined by isolated atom and electron negativity is defined by covalent bond of atom electron affinity accept electron from other element while electron negativity attract shared pair of electron the absolute value of e by v atom per atom kilojoule per mole is regarded in electron affinity and the relative value have no unit in electronegativity in electron affinity chlorine has the most electron affinity while fluorine is the most electronegative element electron affinity is the tendency of an isolated gaseous atom to attract an electron and electronegativity is the tendency of an atom in a molecule to attract shared pair of electron now let us come to factors affecting electron negativity and the factors are atomic radius effective nuclear charge oxidation state and bond energy charge on cation and charge on anion hybridization are also important factors now different is different scales for calculating electronegativity and electronegativity is not a measurable quantity so several numerical scales of electronegativity have been developed and it can also be said that electronegativity is equal to ionization potential plus electron affinity divided by 2 and it is on molecan scale while on pauling scale it is ionization potential plus electron affinity divided by 5.6 now let us come to variation of electronegativity in periodic table variation along period on moving from left to right the electronegativity decreases due to increase in effective nuclear charge and decrease in size there is increase in attraction between the valence electron and nucleus and variation along group on moving down the group the elec the electron negativity decreases because as the force of attraction between the valence electron and the nucleus decreases now there is a question that what is the relation between e n and atomic radius and the answer is the attraction between the nucleus and the valence electron increases as the atomic radius decreases along the period hence en also increases and the electron negative electronegativity value decreases with the increase in atomic radius down a group now there is a question that what is the relationship between en and non metallic property and the answer is non metallic property element have a strong tendency to gain electron therefore electronegativity is directly proportional to the non metallic property of an element and the electronegative the electronegativity is inversely proportional to metallic property of an element on summarizing we get the physical property which is atomic radius ionic radius ionization enthalpy uh, electron gain enthalpy electronegativity the atomic radius decreases across the period while it increases down the group the ionic radius decreases across a period and increases down the group ionization enthalpy increases across the period and decreases down the group the electron gain enthalpy increases across the period and decreases down the group the electronegativity increases across a period and decreases down the group